Hey, what's up everyone and welcome to another, re no, not release day unboxing, a unboxing. This time I am unboxing the Justice League vs. Teen Titans Limited Edition gift set. This is number 18,424 of 57,000, so I didn't, get, I didn't get a great number. But um, I got this. Originally I was just going to get the, the Blu-ray and that's it, which was way cheaper than this edition. But I saw the edition and this box was in really nice condition and I was like, oh, mm, I love collecting things. I want it. So I got it. Let's see. I have it here. I didn't steal it. I bought it. And it was 32 something after tax. That was almost double the amount the regular Blu-ray is. And it comes with, I mean, it comes with a little nice figure right there, which is uh, better than the Harley Quinn figure that came with the uh, Assault on Arkham Collector's Edition, which was not... I mean, it was a great movie, but that was not a good collector's edition. To be fair, I only paid a couple bucks extra, not $13 more, but whatever. Um, and it comes with the graphic novel, which I don't think this is actually based on that graphic novel. I think it's just a regular Teen Titans graphic novel, but I could be wrong. Because um, I'm not a big comic guy. I love, love the animated movies, and I love some of the DC movies, the live action ones. But uh, I love a lot of the DC animated ones I've watched so far. i watched a lot of them, and they're really good. I wish the quality of the live-action movies could match the animated ones. But uh, And I've heard this one's great as well. So I can't wait to see this. Another versus movie from DC. Uh, Batman vs. Robin was last year. Batman v Superman this year. Now we got Justice, the entire Justice League versus the entire Teen Titans. I'm looking forward to it. So here we go. That was the front. Here's the back. Look at that. That's nice. Oh yeah, that's nice. You know that's nice. Here's the side. They got Cyborg and uh, is that Starfire? I think that's Starfire. Yeah, it's Starfire. I wonder if uh, Cyborg's voiced by Michael B. Jordan this time. And that's Raven. Which, by the way, I should mention I... A huge fan of the DC animated shows as well. I don't watch them anymore, but I used to watch the Justice League and Justice League Unlimited and the Teen Titans show. Not the shitty Go one. I heard that's awful. But I used to watch the one with, uh, who's the voice actor? I think Tara Strong voiced someone? Did she voice Raven? She might voice Raven and Teen Titans Go also, so that, may, that might not be a good uh, ex example of uh, someone from the cast. But anyway... Yeah, it includes the graphic novel. And it's only a Best Buy, too. So let's open this. I almost hate to... It, it, it almost hurts to open this, but... Uh, I don't want to hurt it. I don't want to hurt the box. I don't want to hurt myself, either. I might jab myself in the eye with these. Every time I open a box, somehow I, I mess it up, and it, there, there ends up being creases. I'm talking about boxes. Actual boxes, not like cases for Blu-rays. Or video games. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna get it. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. I'm tired of waiting. Um, I don't know if the, these limited editions become rare in the future. Um, I know the uh, Assault on Arkham one that I got, which was the Best Buy exclusive. Well, maybe not Best Buy exclusive, but it was the one that came with the. Uh, if you're a big fan of these DC anime movies, uh, you can look it up too. It came with a figure of Harley Quinn, and uh, I think that's about it. And it came with a box. <laughs> that's about it. Um, I don't think that one's like rare. I think you can get it for like 25 bucks. Maybe not new. New? I don't know. But I saw it on eBay. A couple people were trying to sell it, and no one was buying it. But anyway, I don't know about the other limited editions, but that one wasn't selling on eBay. Um, at least it used. Here you go. There's the figure. Alright, I'm going to open the box gently. Oh, 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 I already, I kind of damaged it. Okay, whatever. Alright, here we go. Okay. Oh, there's the Blu-ray. Nice. Okay. It's all good. I'm not hurting anything. Here we go. Yeah, here's the figure. I'll get that out in a second. And here's the uh, here's the graphic novel, which I'm already not a fan of because it's this crappy hardcover. I knew it was gonna be a hardcover, but I don't know. I was hoping it would be a little bit bigger, maybe the size of this box, which it's not. It's not even, not even. 
<laughs> I was hoping it would be a size of a box at least. I don't like these kind of small hardcover books, but the artwork is very nice. I wonder if this is like a hard graphic novel to get or something. That's why they put it in there, or maybe it is. Maybe it is. Is this blinded by the light? I don't know. I guess it's not. Teen Titans are back. Red Robin, Wonder Girl, Beast Boy, Raven, and Bunker. The Teen Titans are out to make a name for themselves in New York City. Stepping out, blah, 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 blah. Any Justice League mentioned? No, okay. So this isn't even based on... Or this m movie's not based on this. So this is just a regular Teen Titans graphic novel. They probably wanted to add in there because maybe it didn't sell well or whatever. Or maybe it did and everybody loved it and they wanted to give it to the fans. I don't know. Um, give it. Yeah, $13 more. Give it. Uh, <laughs> uh, and here's the Blu-ray. Uh, but we'll unbox that in a second. Let me get this figure out first. Which I don't want to mess this up either. But it looks like, oh, it's one of those, you just pop them right out. There you go. This figure actually is much nicer than the Harley Quinn one, which I don't even know where that one is. He's standing on some stones. If this is the same Robin, let me see. Eh, sorry. Sorry. Eh, just want to make it focus. Focus. Don't focus on my face. There you go. Focus on his. Look. Oh, isn't it? Nice little, uh... Nice little detail there, not amazing, but pretty good. Um, if this is the same Robin from Son of Batman and Batman vs. Robin, then I'm actually looking forward to it because he was a little, he was a little, sm he, he was kind of smart ass to Batman, but he was, um, he wasn't annoying, which I think Robin is a lot of times when I see uh, some of these movies, uh, movies and uh, TV shows that have Robin in it. Um, even though I thought him in Teen Titans, he was great. He was the leader, so um, he wasn't that annoying. So yeah, that's cool. That figure's nice. I'll put that somewhere. Maybe I'll dig out that Harley Quinn one and put it with that one, which doesn't really fit with it, but whatever. Uh, and here you go. There's the front. There's the back. There's Trigon. I remember him from uh, Teen Titans. And uh, yeah, there you go. Here's Teen Titans and here's Justice League. They about to fight. They're going to fight. How much you want to bet? <laughs> I already had this kind of confirmed to me. But how much you want to bet it's going to be uh, like three minutes of like fighting and then, uh-oh, Trigon, we have to fight him. So they team up at the end. Just like in Batman, well, shit, Batman vs. Superman and Batman vs. Robin. Shit, spoilers, I'm sorry <laughs> that spoiled Batman vs. Robin for you, but they barely fight. I'm not going to say if they teamed up at the end, but they barely fight, I'll say that. Um, but I'm still looking forward to it, even if... Uh, hopefully it's just a good little movie. It's short, that's for sure. There's, yeah, Starfire, look. I like the Starfire from the, uh, cartoon that I watched more than I like her from the comics. I know they try to make her more slutty in the, uh, newer Teen Titans, I guess the New 52, which I, I don't, I don't like. Come on. I like, I like innocent, cute, uh, Starfire more than I like, I want to fuck Starfire, so. <laughs> but, um. Here's the, uh, I'm not going to show you the code, obviously, but here's the, uh, Ultraviolet, or whatever. Yeah, Ultraviolet. And here's the DVD and Blu-ray. Which I think one side has Justice League and one side has, no, they both have Justice League. <laughs> Come on, man, really? You could have made one have Justice League and one had T-Titans. You just put both, uh, you can see what they're going to focus on, obviously. Um... But, whatever, they're right. they screwed up there. But for the most part, nice little presentation. Decent little collector's edition. To be fair, these movies are so good that they should probably be the same price as a regular movie Blu-ray. Especially since this one actually has a lot of special features. Uh, okay, well, maybe not a lot. But it comes with uh, a featurette, Heroes and Villains, Raven featurette, Growing Up Titan featurette, Heroes and Villains, Trigon featurette. Two bonus cartoons, and it comes with a sneak peek for Batman the Killing Joke, which I'm looking forward to because I heard that's an excellent comic or graphic novel, and uh, I can't wait to see that. But uh, there you go. Justice League versus Teen Titans. Super excited to watch it. I'm actually probably going to watch it right after this video. So get out of my room. Let me go watch it. Get out. I said get out. Get out.